I think we, we, we are going to end. I mean, 2011 was definitely the year of NFTs. And right now, it's, I mean, you know, the gaming industry is massive. And that's where, you know, NFTs are starting to mingling with gaming, DeFi, this new concept of uh, game, GameFi. Yeah. Um, so, but I, what, what, what gets so inter- in, interested is to have like large brands. You know, I was mentioning about the football club, maybe Formula One. These people taking, you know, the, the game, uh, uh, you know, a step further because most of those brands, they have a massive, you know, um, let's say reputation, uh, audience, followers, and so on. What, what, what we find where would be very interesting is these brands to embrace, uh, you know, the blockchain, you know, revolution with NFTs and giving more power to their followers, users, and fans. That to me is very interesting because it's, you know, it's, it's a lot more inclusive. We're talking a lot, you know, lately around diversity. Um, and, and, and that to, to us is very interesting. Um, so, you know, the, the metaverse, and I'm not necessarily a fan of, of Facebook, but I think Facebook has done an immense, uh, you know, work for everyone around, you know, the crypto space with the metaverse, because they put the notion out there that, you know, every user of Facebook now is aware of metaverse and meta. It's a difficult concept to explain, but it's out there. And that's great. I, yeah, I'm upset that they kind of stole the name Meta, but that's okay. So now we're 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 all in a search for the new the new name that we can call it to not give them any uh, <laughs> any credence. To to circle back on your on your point, you know, I think the metaverse is. I have a feeling that the metaverse is more or less in '98 when internet was created. Yeah, so people are more or less aware, but obviously there's a lot of work to be done in the space. From you know content, um, from culture. Culture is very important. Communities. That's what actually is the juice of Web 3.0. The medium, the way to access the metaverse, the infrastructure, and as well protocol and uh, and standards. Um, so these things will will evolve. But it's to to me, I'm I'm complete. You know, we can talk more about the metaverse. But what happened in the past is completely logical to get this conjunction of concepts to materialize in something that now is called the metaverse and will will probably you know the full version of all those metaverses will probably uh, you know maybe in 5 years time everything is going to be operated or m- most of uh, you know economical activities could be actually operated through it we could actually do uh, uh, um, you know um, a podcast with our glasses at some point or, or mass, but yeah, this is to me the most exciting bit around around the space right now. Yeah, very good. Listen, <laughs> and, and and to be clear, we tried to do we tried to figure out how to do that, and then mm-hmm. we gave up because there quite, there was no way to record it and everything else. <laughs>